Hello, this is Neil Vanderstelt, author of Global Economic Collapse, The New Dark Ages. I'm currently doing research on my new book, The Glass Banking Pyramid, Modern Serfdom, Soft Fascism. Do you know what a serf is? Do you know what fascism is? Are you living within a fascist society? Are you living as a serf to your government? These are questions you better start asking yourself if you want to live to the highest levels of attainment and live within a free society. Yeah, it's just amazing that uh, people don't research their the sources of where their information comes from. Uh, Alex Jones is owned by Ted Anderson, Genesis Communications Network. So if you look up Ted Anderson, Ted Anderson is... Uh, If you put in Ted Anderson and gold, you're going to find out that Ted, Ander Ted Anderson is just a goldsmith. Basically, they're all part of the goldsmith club. So whenever, you're, whenever you listen to Alex Jones, when he talks about the economy, his economic guest he has on will be people like, uh, will be people like Peter Schiff, who promotes gold. I call them gold bugs. Uh, they actually were on a website called 321 Gold at one time. And if you think about it, who owns all the gold? Well, it's the Rothschild family, of course. So uh, Ted Anderson, uh, Midas Resources Incorporated, uh, about us, it says. About us, the world's most trusted source of precious metals. And then it tells you why you should buy gold. So this is the real reason they're having on the, all those economic guests about the economy. They'll have on Peter Schiff. They'll have on Gerald Salente. They'll have on Ron Paul. And these people will push the selling of gold or they will push a gold standard. That's what Ron Paul talks about. Okay. And you'll find that they're not going to have Mr. Neil Vanderstelt on the show I wanted to be on the show. I'd like to debate debate with Alex Jones. And uh, basically, I'd like to inform people about the crimes that the Federal Reserve Bank is doing. But just imagine that these people are using a real-life epidemic to epidemic to, produce, to push the Rothschild gold onto the market. You know, that's who controls all the resources is the Rothschild families, the Rockefeller families. So you're not really getting alternative media when you listen to Alex Jones. And that's why if I, I've called on his show, I've talked to Lyndon LaRouche on his show. I talked to um, Gerald Salente, but th they won't let a person like me talk. They'll cut me off before I could get my point across. They, they know I'm knowledgeable, so they won't have me on their show. I've asked to be on his show and they won't have me, you know, Alex Jones will have a wrestler guy talking about the economy, but he won't have someone like me who study the economy almost every day on a religious basis practically since 2000, okay? And I know all about the corruption and all, all about the BS uh, statistics about the economy, and they talk about the same stuff too, but the, the point of the matter is they do it in a propaganda, a, a, in a sense of propaganda, not to really find a true solution, but to produce a plan B to the same cartel, the, Roth, the uh, Rothschild Rockefeller cartel who own the resources. So they're just setting it up to get to let you understand the problem with the economy and to set up their solution, their plan B solution which is looking to the solution of the people who created the problem in the, in the first place. So you're not getting anything different. They're just getting you used to the idea of what their plan B is. So when they do it, then you'll go right along with it. So again, Genesis Communications Network, you can read up about it. That's who hosts Alex Jones. And then down here it says, uh, 
There, there was also a Jeff Rents. Jeff Rents was on that program, and they kicked him off of it because he had to dispute. It looks like the reason was because he had to dispute with Alex Jones. <laughs> yeah, like Alex Jones says, you can't make this stuff up. <laughs> So anyway, I'm Neil Vanderstelt. Thanks for listening. I'd like to be on the Alex Jones Show, but I guess he doesn't want to go head-to-head with me because I don't want to promote gold. Thanks for listening.